Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today, I want to introduce you to an incredibly robust species of fairy shrimp, which is found across many parts of the United States. This is known as the rock pool fairy shrimp, or scientifically, Brancanecta packardi. Now, the rock pool fairy shrimp has a broad distribution across North America. It can be found east of the Continental Divide and on the west side of the Great Plains. Its range extends from southern Canada all the way to central Mexico. Within these regions, it inhabits a variety of ephemeral wetland habitats, such as rock outcropping pools and other slightly alkaline to alkaline ephemeral pools. So, in terms of culturing these shrimp, I use a mixture of sand, compost, and calcium carbonate as a substrate. After these eggs are submerged in water for about 24 hours, they begin to hatch and grow quite rapidly. This species is one of the fastest maturing shrimp I've ever grown, reaching sexual maturity within just a few days. However, their growth rate slows significantly once they reach sexual maturity. As far as behavior, these shrimp tend to be quite sporadic as they aimlessly swim in all directions. These fairy shrimp will filter feed in the water column, but will also scrape and collect detritus from the bottom of the habitat. They tend to do this when there is no food in the water column. Males are on the constant lookout for females, with the mating process being just about a few seconds. Males will use their second antenna to latch onto the females. Now, let's talk about some unique features of this species. Males have a distinctive medial process, or a growth, which is on the inner side of their basal segment on the second antenna. This growth is somewhat in a pointed shape and points towards their body. Females, on the other hand, have very evident lobes on abdominal and genital segments. The largest of the lobe is actually on the first genital segment of the female. Well, this is all the information I have for this short video, but feel free to watch the remaining clips. And also check out in the description, I have more information about this species on my website. Other than that, if you like this content, please give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel.